Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Delhi Tarot and these are your new moon reading for the sun, moon and the rising sign of Gemini. Gemini, please keep in mind that this is your general reading for the new moon which is on 2nd of March 2022 and I shall be doing your quick reading, I shall be pulling out your energies, I shall be pulling out your tarot cards and then a monology card to check the energies around your new moon. I was explaining it in my other uh, videos that new moon is a very, very good time when you set the intentions to set up something new, uh, new goals, new targets. You want to welcome some new person in your life. So anything new which you want to grow, expand and prosperous is the new moon targets. And you keep on strengthening your intentions till full moon and then you see the results that's a lovely time from new moon to full moon sun moon and rising gemini okay what is your energy on new moon and you have the deceit now when you have a card of deceit deceit is an energy which tells you that you are sharing all your important sensitive information with such a pure heart and soul to people around you but out of that bunch of people, there is someone who is playing, you know, uh, playing black, not so genuine, is becoming a little envious with your achievements, with your good news. The person is playing bad at your back. It is important for you to filter good people, good energy people. Now, there is a way of how you check when you feel you know, try to sense your feelings, how you feel in company of a person and how you feel in sharing some information with a person. Your heart will always tell you that what is the intention of other person. Your own heart will tell you that how you are feeling when you are in the company of the said person. You have to identify that person from your network and you have to be very, very cautious. But yes, I am sensing Gemini that even at workplace, Somebody is trying to play at your back. Somebody is trying to be, you know, criticizing, is making, giving bad word of mouth for you and your work. And you have to be very, very careful when you are sharing any information with such people. Okay, now let us see what do we have in your tarot. What energies do we have for you on this new moon, sun, moon and rising. Okay, we have three of wands. For you, Gemini, we have a card of temperance, major arcana, and we have four of cups. So you have one major arcana, which says that, yes, it's time for you to be very careful. Again, I was telling you to be when you have a energy of deceit here, you have to take one step at a time. You have to take precaution at each and every step. Before you take the first step, you need to have proper planning, proper information. And when you shift from one step to another step, you have to be very careful. You have to check all the pros and cons, the plus and minus, the strength and the weaknesses at each and every step. And it's time for you to be very, very careful, not only just with people, but be very careful in spending money. This new moon I'm telling you to be very careful, Gemini, with all people in your personal professional network. You have to see that what all precautions you need to take when you're taking even a very, very important decision or you're making any investment or you're thinking about even making an investment. You have to be very careful. And then you have three of wands, which says that you have already done little hard work on some aspect. You are now waiting for the result and it is going to bring good luck to you it is going to bring the positive outcome to you you are now in a zone in a mental zone in a you know in that frame of mind mentally that you are now planning to have something which is far-sighted you are doing anything not just for short term but now you are doing anything especially with professional level something which you are citing to be the far-sightedness you are making a long-term planning something which is sustainable, something which is long lasting or maybe something which you are pouring your hard work to something and you are making that the life purpose as well. And you have four of cups and I can sense from your energy when I saw this four of cups, you are not getting that excited, the kind of 
opportunity you are getting or the kind of projects you are getting or the kind of work you are getting or the kind of people you are getting in your personal professional life i also sense that you are not so happy with your love life and this time is not going to be permanent please know this is just a temporary phase when you are not showing excitement to any aspect of your life whether it's personal or professional the time is just average right now it's important for you to just pass on this time and let us see what do we have in monology for you what message do we have from monology this is going to be a short video please pick it up what resonates with you please leave the rest for others i always forget to tell these things now okay let us see what messages do we have for you on this new moon and we have confidence is your key to success show great confidence great enthusiasm and you're going to get the best of benefit from your personal professional life and then we have a time to give rather than take it's important for you to share what you are feeling with your near and dear ones it's important for you to show your wisdom and knowledge to people it's important for you that you give space to people give priority to the relationship what i am sensing from this card is it's time to give importance and priority to your relationships as well in life whether it's a it's a personal relationship or it's a professional relationship but overall your own skills your own confidence your own will power is going to be the key to success in your personal professional life So dear friends that was your quick reading for this new moon and I also wanted to make a quick announcement I have recently started doing your birthday readings for your money career finances and I shall be doing few more readings for love and relationships as per your birthdays but those are very very quick short readings so I've started including it as YouTube shorts because a lot of people requested me to do that so please do shower some love on those YouTube you know um shots as well and i will see you next time very soon be blessed